Hey, what is going on guys? Dark Dragon from Trophies Achieved here and today I'll be showing you how to get the trophy slash achievement, the collector, which you can obtain in Dangerous Hunt 2013 by collecting all the antlers in the game. But without further ado, let's get straight into this and level 1 is take the shot and after you meet your wolf marksman target, on the floor further to the right is the first antler. All the antlers on this level are straight after each other. The second one is after you encounter this little ditch straight after the first, you will see it under the ditch and hidden amongst the rocks and the final one of this level is as you make your way back up the hill and jump the ditch it is directly ahead I guess they've made it easy for the first level uh, uh, the next level has is sandstorm there are no uh, antlers on that level so let's make it straight to the level 3 which is dry river and as the level starts you'll encounter a little cutscene with a buffalo Simply learn, do your newly learnt avoid attack and after you take down the buffalo, the handler is on the floor to the left hand side behind the midi pack. Straight after that you encounter a large wooden structure. Instead of heading left and continuing with the level, turn right and you'll see the antler on the floor next to a midi pack. The next one is pretty hard to find as it is in a huge area but as you cross the large wooden bridge make your way to the very back of this new area there's like two massive fields um, if you see a cutscene with a rhino that means you've gone too far but simply make your way to the very back of this le of this level of map area <laughs> try and avoid the buffaloes unlike I did and once you see the back of the map start turning left and it, you'll see it directly ahead sort of on the back corner of the map of this area the next level is respect your prey and as soon as the level starts and you make your way off the plane look left and you'll see it right at the start next to a stone wall after you take down the two deer with your brother and you make your way into this new area turn left and make your way up the incline jump the gap and you will see the outlet on your left hand side After the moose runs at you and you injure him, instead of turning right and following him up that path, turn left and look on the floor and you will see it there ready for the taking. The next level is keep moving. As the level starts you will see a little cutscene of the deer running up the hill. Instead of going right and following it, turn left and you will see a little cave well hidden in the sort of back corner of that on the left side and you'll see the antler in there. This one is further along the level when the jaguars start attacking from the trees. As you make your way down this little jump, instead of following left and following your objective path, turn right up this hill, avoiding any attacking animals as you do. And at the very top of the hill, there will be a large bush with the antler well hidden behind it up the top. Later on in the level as you enter the swamp you will get uh, uh, attacked by loads of crocodiles or alligators and as you encounter your third one uh, if you sort of hug the left hand side of the swamp you will see the antler is well hidden in the reeds behind a medipack. This is a pretty tough one to get so if you sort of hug the left hand side and as you see the medipack follow that little path up and it will be well hidden amongst the reeds. The next level is up and out and at the very start of the level you'll enter a sort of cave with a ton of baboons that run away. Instead of going right and following the cave out, head straight ahead and hop, hop up these massive ledges and on the right in some bushes you'll see the antler. As you make your way out of the canyon after being attacked by tons and tons of baboons along that river, make your way along this path and follow it as normal, but as you make your way up to the next level in the sort of split turn directly behind you and you'll see another path heading back that way and the antler will be just on top of that uh, sort of cliff edge and the final one of this level is near the end as you'll see a massive stone wall on your left hand side sort of follow that stone wall all the way along to the end and it will lead you to the last antler of the level. The next level is the west face. As you enter the first sawmill, 
sort of hug the right hand side of the um, sort of build and be careful to defend yourself because you will get attacked a lot in this area and as you keep right as you exit make a very sharp right and you'll see the antler hidden in a little groove the next one is after you exit the sawmill you'll see a fork in the path turn right and make your way up the very top of this hill and you will see the antler enjoying the view at the very top The final one of this level is just as you get attacked by loads of wolves, make your way to the sort of back of the area where the fence is and as where the fence meets the rock you will find the last antler lane on the floor. Just be careful not to get cornered by loads of wolves like I did. <laughs> Moving on to the next level, high jungle. As this level's sort of near the start you'll jump across a little ridge and make your way up. Instead of going up straight away, look to your right and you'll see an antler hiding in the grass. The next one is after you make your way through the ruins and go under the ground. Instead of going, keep going, look in this little crater and you'll find an antler next to a medipack. The next one is after you get attacked by tons and tons of lions and you make your way up this hill. Instead of going right and following that path, if you look to your left you'll see a little uh, sort of ledge you can jump to and the antler is just on in a little gap in the cliff. The next one is just run. At the very start of this level if you hug the left hand side just before that first little village hut you'll find a secret little passage in a little canyon and at the end of this passage is the last uh, the first antler of the level. The next one is after you get poisoned you'll meet see this little wooden structure. If you head left from there you'll find a, a massive crack in the wall sort of crawl through that and the antler will be on the floor just after that. The la this last one is at the very end of the level so be careful not to exit the canyon and end the level. On the right hand side after the baboons attack is a very well hidden ledge which you need to jump up on um, to get the last antler. You will hear shotgun shells of your brother so it is right at the end of the level just be careful not to exit the level. The last one is the next one is out cold. As you enter the sort of cliffy area and you have to jump the gaps make your way under this area and the antler will be in the little corner up under that this one is quite hard to find basically all i did on this is hug the right hand side of the area once you enter the area with the jagged rocks and the jaguars jumping around if you hug the right hand side eventually you will see a little alcove in the cliff with a tree and the antler is just sitting next to the tree in that area The next one is when your brother is getting attacked on the frozen lake by loads of wolves and you're trying to snipe and defend him. As you make your way across the very end and make your way onto the riverbed, instead of turning left and f making your way over to your brother, go straight ahead and on the other side of the riverbank you will see an antler chilling enjoying the sea sh view. Moving on to the next level, stay alive. As you start the level there will be a fork in the path straight away, head right and on top of a crate there will be your first antler of the level. The next one is after a little cutscene and a black lion will attack you from the trees. As you make your way past this lion there will be a little medipack on the floor. Avoid that medipack and hang right and circle round on this little area here. Just be careful not to jump down because I don't think you can get back up. And instead of going that way, head your way up this hill and you'll find another antler sitting on top of a crate. The next one is easy to find. As you make your way over to the gate you have to blow up, you'll see a little cave to your left hand side. Hug the left uh, wall of this cave and make your way up to the very top level of this cave. And on the very top you'll find the third antler sitting on yet another crate. Moving on to the level, this is my hunt. As you slide down after defending your brother once again, you'll enter a little scene with your, some jaguars on the hunt. Take down the two jaguars that are hunting their prey and on the very cliff edge next to the tree directly ahead of you, you will find the antler on the very near the tree.
The next two are very fairly hard to find. Once you enter the area where you're taking down your hunts, huntsman lion target on the very top of the ruins, and look towards the gate you're about to go through and turn right, take a shot right and make your way up the hill. There is an antler sort of chilling in the very back corner of this map. The next one is sort of right next to it but further back towards the way you came and on top of the very hill and the sort of the highest point of this area you'll find an antler in the ruins. The next level, Showdown, a nice short level. As you see a little cutscene of the bear attacking some wolves, turn to your right and sort of hug that rock to the right and on the back side of that rock you will find an antler stuck to it. The next one is as you enter the ice cave, look left straight away and you will see an antler camouflage in the snowy uh, sort of entrance. And as you exit the ice cave, turn right instead of following the bear left and you'll see a little ridge, alcove and an antler hiding inside. The final level of the game is make a stand. As you start the level and make your way up the stairs and you hop down here, look to your right and you will see some an antler hiding in the boulders. Once you take down your marksman lion target who's sitting in the tree, make your way up the stairs and you'll see a antler on your right hand side against the wall and the cliff edge. And the, the final antler of the game is when you're entering the Colosseum showdown area against the big boss, look to your right hand side for the massive crack in the wall and you'll see the final antler. I hope this guide helps guys, if you have any question about more detailed explanations just leave a comment below and I'll get straight to you. Thanks for watching and adios.